Motor Week is made possible by rockauto.com. Now, Craig's trips haven't always been as straightforward as that one. Why, he and co-producer Maria Purdom recently came back from one trip a little spooked. They didn't want to discuss with us what really happened, but then we already knew that the high road can be a very strange place. What's wrong, Craig? I don't know. Maybe we ought to go in there and call somebody. Yeah, let's do that. What's going to happen next? I don't know. Hello, can we use your phone? Anyone home? Sure, come on in. Oh, great. All right. Excuse me, um, can we use your phone? We need a tow. Yeah, sure, I'm finishing up here. Hi, I'm Jerry. Uh, Craig, uh, it's Maria over there. Hi, how you doing? Hi. Wow, what a great collection. Is this a 32? Yeah, it's a little deuce pickup truck. Wow, it's really neat. Phone's right over here. Thanks. Wow, I haven't seen a set of slicks like this since 1960. Well, that's the latest compound. Latest compound? Hey, Craig, come over here. Check out this 1944. All right. Isn't it neat? Beautiful. Not bad for a 20-year-old car, huh? A 20-year-old car? Where's my manners? Uh, the phone's in here. Let me get you something to drink. Well, the phone's over there. And Ruthie, get these folks a couple of Cokes. Sure. Hi there. Hi, how are you? All right. It's hey, neat. Hey. Look at all this old neat stuff. Strolls are in the holder right there. Oh, thanks. Wow, I haven't seen a bottle like that since Nixon was president. Did you say Nixon is president? What happened to President Eisenhower? Uh, I'm going to use the phone. Just you know why. I just love Buddy Holly. Yeah, it's a shame he died last year. Last year? Yeah. Will I don't know, it just stopped. <laughs> it's a Mazda. MX3. No you know, a Mazda. What year is it? 1992. 1992. See you in 32 years, wise guy. Same to you, buddy. The towing guy just hung up on me. I'll tell you what. Let me take a look at it. It's a pretty futuristic looking car you got there. I don't think you'll have any trouble. Now. It started. Hey, where'd he go? I don't know. Let me go thank him. Hey, thanks. So where'd he go? You don't want to know. Consider, if you will, two weary travelers who stumble through a portal where the appreciation of automobiles transcends both time and space. An appreciation so intense that it could only exist in the mind. A mind lost in the high road zone.